They say this is a big rich town I just come from the poorest part Bright light city life, I gotta make it This is where it goes down I just happen to come up hard Legal or illegal, baby, I gotta make it I never it. took a straight path nowhere Life's full of twists and turns, bumps and bruises I live. I... Hello everyone, this is Thomas Stevens, I speak the truth, brought to you by GoToFileLife.com, and we're here to discuss Power, Season 5, Episode 5, Happy Birthday. Again, I'm your host, Thomas Stevens, and I have my guest, uh, B, how are you, B? Hey, man, don't Google, don't ask Siri, ask B, I'm here. <laughs> I hear you. Quanda, how are you? Hey, 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 everybody. I'm good. How's everybody doing? Nikita, how are you? I'm here. Don't sleep. Don't sleep on me tonight. <laughs> I hear you. I hear you. Oh, and uh, our usual, the usual suspect, uh, Unique LaBelle, she's out tonight. So we have a very, very special guest. All the way from the Ville, Brownsville. What's up, Rashawn? How you doing? I'm good. What's good, my dude? How you? I'm doing well. Doing well. Doing very well. So uh, we're going to start the show all kind of different tonight. And uh, I, I just want to – I'm, I'm going to spit this line to y'all that, that, that came out of the show, and I just want to get, get each one of your feelings about the line because I, I thought it was very deep, and especially with the person that it was coming from. But um, here it is. Loyal only to your own cause. Sounds like ghosts. What 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 are your feelings about that, B? Um, I mean it's the truth. That's what it is. You know what I mean? Uh, Tommy, you know, anytime Ghost is off his game, that's when Tommy's on his. See, Tommy the only one that don't figure out that Tyreek, the one that you know. Gave your boy the heads up, so that's just that, that's just uh, Tommy being on his game right now. Right. Okay. All right, Chiquita. What's your take on that line by old Tommy? Um, I don't like the line. I mean, Tommy always, you know, say that or whatever when it comes to ghosts. But I feel like Ghost just wants to be a changed man. Um. He's he's loyal. He's loyal to, I mean, he's loyal to Tommy. He's loyal to his family. He just wants to change. And now you see how he still, you know, has Tommy back no matter what. So I don't agree with it. Okay. All right. Well, that's, that's good. A different take. Quanda, what's, what's your feeling about it? Actually, I agree with Shakita. Okay. Um. I just I just don't agree with I agree with Ghost and, and and what he's doing. He wants to be a changed man and and he he's loyal he's loyal to that and Tommy he he does say that a lot. So but we we kinda see how his role is being played. He's kinda, you know, back and forth. We don't know what he's thinking. But so I have to agree with Shakita with that. Okay. Rashawn, what do you think about that line? What do you think about what what, what Tommy said to Rick? Um, I think the you know Tommy's assessment of what Tariq did is real real in line with with his father Ghost. The apple don't fall far from the tree, right? So um, when he when he spit that line to Tariq, it was it was dead on. Yeah, Ghost is in a changing phase, but if you look at what he's done in the past, for the most part, it was for Ghost's own glory. So it was always to help himself out. So in that instant, when Tommy said that to Tariq, he was saying, you're, you're very much like your father, right? you only looking out for yourself. So I think it was, I think it was dead on. Yes, indeed, uh, Ghost is changing. And Tommy has said that, but every time, like B said, you know, it's been more or less when 
when uh, Tommy's been on his game and Goat's been flipping. So um, I'm going to go with that. Okay. All right. Sounds good. I, hey, I totally agree. I think that if, if, it, if the moral, if it fits, it fits Goat's narrative, that's what Goat's going to do. Like with the, the just, to, just to go back a few episodes ago, back to the to the money, money laundering. When Tommy asked him, he's like, nah, man, I'm trying to do the right thing for the club and this, this, and that. But then he needed the money for the for the building, for, for the Queens project. So what did he do? You know what, Tommy? We're going to we're gonna go and do things like we used to do it. You know, mm-hmm. go ahead and clean the money. Because it, it, it fitted his narrative. So I, I totally agree with the, with the assessment that, that, that Tommy threw out there. <clears throat> okay. Chiquita. What's what's the real reason Teresi decided to spare spare Tommy instead of Sammy? What what do you think the real reason behind that? Um, the real reason is I feel like Teresi, he's just I mean, he's getting old now. He 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 just felt like being in jail, what's the reason why you know, that he didn't snitch. Like, he just felt like maybe they don't have his back. You know how you get mixed feelings, I guess, when you're locked up? I mean, I don't know about it or whatever. But okay. I feel like he wants to keep – he wants to stay out. He wants to – he doesn't want to go back to jail. He really okay. doesn't. So, really, he'll just go ahead and kill his friend and uh, keep the role going as far as trying to, you know, snitch and get information on Tommy. But I really truly believe, believe that, you know, he doesn't love Tommy like that. Um, if he did, he would have been, came back in Tommy's life, and not now, you know. Okay. All right. Kwanda, what's your assessment on that? Um, oh, that's a good one because – with Teresi, I just don't know what he's really feeling. Like sometimes I feel that he he's really with Tommy, but this episode, I think the reason why he was gonna choose his friend to kill, I'm kind of leaning towards the same thing where he wanna be out of the game. And yeah, he didn't snitch for all those years, but like he just said, he's older now. If he had to do that, you know, to keep stay from out of jail, then so be it, you know. So right. that's just what he had to do. So I think he's thinking at the bigger picture now, you know, now that okay. he's older. So that's my take on that. Oh, that, ma- that, ma- that makes sense. Rashawn, what, what, what's your take on that? What What's the real reason why Teresi decided to spare Tommy instead of Sam? Yo, I just think on the real, 25 years in the bing, you just start to look at things real different. If you look at his words, he was saying to the to the effect that they didn't take care of his wife, you know, um, and is really not a rat if you don't care about the person. So I think to to that point, he's just saying, you know, he'd rather be out, you know, like the the family don't really love love him and all that he protected with his secrets and whatnot and not snitching on Vincent's dad and all these other guys, it's it's all about now he wants to be out. So I just think I'm um he's gonna he's gonna be an informant and give up like he said, give up ghosts and, and Tommy on, on a platter. Or oh, that was wild what he said with the China though. That was wild. Um, right. <laughs> <laughs> but, but you know, just to stay out, you know, because the game is different, you know, and the game has passed him, uh, passed him by. Loyalty ain't, ain't what it used to be. So, you know, I'm going to kill my friend but because I, I need to stay out. So I'm going a, I'm to a do, do him, but I'm going to keep Rob, Tommy around. He don't care about Tommy, though. He don't love Tommy, just like – I don't know if it was Keita or or um, Kwanda that said he would have been came back for Tommy years ago. Right. Right. Okay. All right, B, are you on the same parallel with them, or are you thinking something different? Um. Am I am I still muted? You can hear me. Okay. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, I pretty much agree. I agree, man. You know, Teresa, um, all over the place right now, man. He, he, you know, at the end of the day, he pretty much don't pretty much did in twenty five years, man. Then you talking about twenty five years that he sat there and did his thing and they ain't did shit for him. Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It, it gives you a name, but that's it. Yeah, he ten toes down, but. But they ain't doing that for him. You know what I mean? Right. Like like uh, what Vincent told him, yeah, man, I've been meaning to get by and see Connie. 25 years you've been meaning? <laughs> 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 he, he tell me you've been meaning. And so, like, when he said that, like, you could see Teresa's face, like, oh, fuck, are you tripping? You know what I mean? So right. he's just holding it in. So now he's just like, you know what I'm saying, like they don't shut him out behind that bullshit. Shit, he know what it is. Ain't no loyalty yeah. to, to, to his ass. Yeah. <laughs> so, you know what you're, I mean? You're right. But at, at, hey, but at the end of the day, you, we know he don't give a damn about ghosts. And that Tommy thing kind of up in there. You know what I'm saying? Right. Like, shoot, he, was, he was willing to shoot his damn best friend for that. So, you know what I'm saying? I ain't going to see him say he don't love Tommy because that is his son. Right. You know what I mean? At the end of the day, that is his son. He... Actually, sign that birth certificate and everything. You know what I mean? They don't show it all that, but I mean, he don't know it. But see, he's right. trying to get to know him, so he's stuck between the two. You know what I'm saying? But hey, at the end of the day, I'm 25 years. I'm taught his ass a lot. Yeah, I hear that. I'm with that. Okay. <clears throat> all right, Kwanda. What What in the hell is Kanan's plan? <laughs> what 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 is Kanan's plan? He's he got like four or five different plans going. I mean, what what, what is yeah? Oh, Kanan get on my nerves. But he, I think, I think his plan is really to get on the side. I think he's trying to get in. He's trying to get on the Italian side some way. So. But I don't know. I I really don't know why he did. What's up with him and the um, you know, the dope scene or whatever, and him going and killing the uh, killing the guys. Like I don't, I don't get that. I don't know what he's trying to cook up. But I don't trust him. Never liked him, and they still got him. I don't get it. Well, you, well, you know, he he he, you know, he he doing all that with uh with laces to make it look like it's some mm-hmm. real shit going on with Dre now, you know what I'm saying? Like, he's not yep. without Dre people. Yeah. Okay, well, yeah. Okay, I didn't think about it like that, but yeah, that Be- makes sense. Because that's what he said to, to Tommy. He was like, yo, we need to go, you know, make this beef with them, so then it, it looks like it's uh, some internal beef. So... Um, that's why Dre and what's his name, Cristobal, um, they already knew like, yo, it must be Tommy or Ghost that's that's doing that to their to their organization. Mhm. Mhm. Okay. Okay. All right. Okay. Chiquita, does does Tamika trust Angela? Ah. Uh. I really don't know. Like, Tamika knows that Angela is really, really smart. Like, she knows this. She's, she's already said this. But she, and she doesn't want Angela to fail, and she knows Angela's history. So, in a way, she knows that Angela can do it, but then she also knows that Angela has a history of, you know, F and up, basically. Right. Um, right. When it comes to, you know, that ghost and all that mess. So she knows in the back of her head that Angela is a little messy, but then she can still crack the case and do what she's supposed to do, she, you know, supposed to do as far as with the um, investigation. So I'm not sure. Oh. I'm not sure what um, Tamika is thinking now, but Tamika is smart. She's a smart woman, and she knows. She knows what's going on, I feel like. And she she can she can tell she can tell when someone's lying or whatever it may be. Okay. All right. Rashawn, does 
Does does Tamika trust Angela? What's your thoughts on that? Yo, truth be told, my dude, um, nobody on here should be trusted, right? Like, um, <laughs> right. <laughs> you, 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 uh, on the real, like big old fact, should. big old fact. Um, I think she got. She got one eye open on on Angela. Um, definitely knows that Angela, like Keita said, is smart or whatever. But um, got one eye open. That's why. But but she's given. She she's very transparent though. Like if she finds right. out some information, she comes and tells Angela. Um, she involves Mock and and the other the the white dude. Like when she finds something out, the the black dude told her about he she, Angela had him go get the files and you know so she came to Angela with it. So I, I think she's 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 giving her some rope, you know, and letting Angela hang herself. But trust definitely don't trust her though. Right, right. Now I don't I, I don't think so either. She she has a a, a look. You know when when Angela comes around and every time Angela speaks, she has this she has this look. But uh, B, so so Teresi just dropped the first nugget on Ghost and Tommy. Can we officially say he's a rat? Oh, most definitely, he, he's a rat. <laughs> he is a rat. Yeah. <laughs> you know, I mean, I know it, it's supposed to be like what he said is his business. But no, nigga, we been new Ghost of Time. He a rat. Yeah. In our eyes, he a rat. Yeah, he don't really know Ghost of Time, but we know him. We don't, right. spend, we don't spend four seasons <laughs> with them guys, so he's a rat. Right, right. Easy. Fuck Teresa. Yeah. Fuck him and his 25 yeah. years. He a rat. Right. <laughs> right, right. Right, Teresa. Hey, Teresa. Teresa, he's Teresa Madeline. All right. Shakita, what what's Tommy's plan for that FBI's tracker? What what do you think the plan is for that tracker? First, I want to say Terence is dead. Like I said last um, show, Terence is okay. dead. But um, okay. as far as Tommy's plan, I was a little clueless with that one. But I feel like he's he's going to help Angela. You know, probably crack the. Um, Jimenez or whatever, but um, I'm just not I'm I'm not sure where Tommy is going with this tracker. Maybe you guys can explain it a little more to me, but um, I'm not sure what he's gonna do with that one. Okay, B, what's your thoughts on the tracker? On that tracker, um, it's it's gonna be one of two things. He gonna he gonna get it. Um, under Dre, or he gonna get it under the Italian, one of the two. But he's gonna try and X out one of them. You know what I mean? Don't be surprised that he might put it on Chicago now. You know what I mean? I don't know. See, Tommy, Tommy up against the wall right now. You right. know what I mean? Like she, Chicago really come, gonna come for the head. You know what I mean? So, right. so Tommy back is against the wall. Shit, he know he got to get Angela off his ass because Angela don't play. You know what I mean? He can't stand her, and he knows she don't play. That motherfucker yeah. Angela gonna do her job. But right, right now I'm, I'm a. Hey, they from the same hood, um, and right now I'm Team Angela. Fuck Tasha. So, 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 hey, he gonna help Angela out. <laughs> hey, uh, okay, Rashawn, what, what are your thoughts on that tracker? How do how do you think Tommy gonna tie that in? Yo, that cat is in a squeeze, yo. Um, he getting it from everywhere. So I mean, that tracker could go in <laughs> in wild different directions, yo. Um, right. But I think his biggest obstacle has to be the dude that almost bodied him in Chicago. So, um. Okay. I'm I'm along that that line with B. I think he he got to get that cat off his back. I think he knows he got his ears up about Teresi, you know, when they had they sit down, and I think he know he can't trust Teresi. So right. I don't, I don't think he's really too worried, too tough about him. Um, he can't really get it, Dre. 
Um, so I think the only one he could really get his hands at and probably would mean him the most harm if he don't get that bread is going to be the Chicago cat. Right. Um, and that would give him somebody, to, uh, you know, to, to, to hand over to Angela. Um, but I can't see him getting too close to Dre and the Italians, they ain't, they ain't banging with him and, she ain't really looking for the Italians no way, so. Right. Okay. Well, I'm, I'm glad you brought it up. That was one of my, my, my questions on down the line was, was Tommy able to see Teresi as, as, as a rat from the conversation they had at, at Tommy's place? You think he was able oh. to see that he was the rat? Yeah, yeah, because I, I peeped how, you know, like his – um, he, he even questioned Teresi like um, right. to to that language like uh, you you a rat you would do that you know and then you know Teresi's response you know like it ain't really you know ratting if if it ain't nobody that you don't really give a fuck about so right. um, that really perked it up like I don't think this cat really care for me. There's got to be something going on. And then, you know, Proctor dropped something before, you know, him and Angela met Tommy, too. And to Proctor's right. like, I don't think that right. Teresi is a, you know, but it wasn't it wasn't reassuring. So I think Tommy's picking up all the clues and, and, and going to play Teresi really at arm's length. Right. No, I totally agree. I totally agree. Okay, Kwanda, will will Tariq help sink Ghost? Because right now I see he's he's totally at odds with Ghost. He's like fuck your drug money, all this X Y Z. Do do you think he's gonna help sink Ghost? Mm, that's a good one because um I don't think he's gonna help sink Ghost, but I think the way Tyreek is going about things, I think Ghost is going to be able to kind of see, look at himself from a different standpoint, you know, because now he's going to see his son acting the way he's acting and he's going to be like, dang, like that's, that's me. So he going to, I think that's really what's going to be exposed. Like he's going to really take a step back and say, that's me. This is this is me. This is how I act. So I might need to do something different. So I think that's probably. What, but I don't think you're gonna sink them. Okay. Well, what are your what are your thoughts on Reek Shakita? Is he is he gonna be able to? Is, is he gonna is he gonna help sink ghosts? He's gonna. I I think to Reek, he's gonna try. But you gotta okay. remember the conversation that. Tommy had with um, Tariq, and so I'm I'm so happy that Tommy is starting to be a little smart this season um, instead of being so messy. Because Tommy had me gone last um, last season, but um, I really think I really think that Tariq she, he's going to try, but Tommy is on him on to him, and then you got to remember his dad is gone. Ghost is always up. He's 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 up up one against everybody. So go go smart. Okay. I, I can't wait to see how this plays out. But Tariq, boy, little boy, sit down somewhere. You mad? Your daddy <laughs> didn't tell you, you know, that he wasn't a gangster and all this. Sit down. Go and sit down. Right. Go to school. Yeah. No. <laughs> no. Reek. 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 Wild with that. All right. So so B. Ghost has almost lost everything he loves. Is it is it time is it time for for Ghost to, to leave Ghost behind him and to and, and to, to, to I guess to be Jamie? You know, to I guess so he can get a so he can have a better life because that's what he wants to be anyway. So is it is it time to leave Ghost behind so he can be Jamie? Is it time? I mean, it's he's been trying to make it. He's he's been trying to like be Jamie since season one. Um, 
you know, he's almost at the point of no return, man. You know, it's like, you know, he don't lost everything, you know. Losing your daughter, you know what I'm saying, or a family member. Um, then you got you got people on the other side trying to bring that they trying to bring that negative life towards you, you know what I'm saying? Like you're doing everything to stay away from it. And you know what I'm saying, he's doing everything, but you know, you know how he is now, you know what I mean? Like I say, he that he he don't get beat down. But boy, he always come out on top. Because he pretty he, right. he pretty damn smart. He always thinking, you know what I mean? Just like he got up under Dre. He got up under Dre, but Councilman Tate pulled Dre back in. You know what I mean? Yeah. So yeah. you know what I mean? It's just it's just one of them situations where you like, man, what are you gonna do now? You know what I mean? And you know, I mean, it, it might be time for him to uh let goes go, but but it's too much going on for him to let it go right now. Right. Right. Okay. All right. Well, Sean. Okay. Um, you want me to ask, answer the same thing? No, nah, no. Nah, I got some. I got some for you. Okay. What, all right. What was the angle? What What's angle? Angela's angle for approaching Tommy for that deal? Because it. I'm I'm sure it's not what it seems with Angela. I'm, I'm sure she has some type of ulterior motive. So what's what what's the angle behind Angela approaching Tommy for that deal? Um, she she got the ghost syndrome too, though. Um, <laughs> meaning <laughs> she always looking out for self. You right. know, she feel she feel the heat. She feel the heat coming on her as well. So, you know, I got this little bit of information. I got to still cover my track. Yo, because that female um, that female cop is on her ass. Is yeah, on her Martinez. Head, right? Yeah, so Martinez is, is, is on her. So Angela always been out for Angela, you know. Yeah, right. she's wild, smart, and, and, and whatnot, but she's always about covering her her own track. So I, I got Tommy because I know that, you know, they have the tracker on him. So if I get him on his side, but everybody trying to protect themselves because, you know, you seen when, you know, after Angela left, Proctor was like, yo, they going to know that we, we killed Markham. No, they're not. You know what I mean? So everybody trying to <laughs> cover themselves. But her angle is definitely strictly about Angela um, um, to save to save her herself and, and this whole mess. Okay. All right. Well, Chiquita, it wouldn't be a show if I didn't ask you about Angela. So what's, what's, what's Angela's angle for approaching Tommy for that? Classic. <laughs> <laughs> you know I don't fuck with Angela. <laughs> Why ask me about Angela? Well, no. This Now, I will say, yes, Angela is for self. But, Rashawn, you got to think, we need Angela right now in this situation right here because everything is messy, and that lady is on her, but Angela is going to find a way to cover something up. And, yes, yeah, she's smart as hell, but she's going she's gonna to figure some way out or put it on you know, end up cracking some type of other case so everything else can kind of calm down. So she's going to find some type of way. Um, yeah, I don't know what she's uh, with that track or whatever, but it's going to help her with that, um, Jimenez. But she really needs to listen to Tamika on that. Like, leave that alone for right now, you know, because you're already in the hot seat. Why are you doing more? Go, okay. go and try to crack something else. Okay. She done. She done gave up that little bit of cat to that dude. That got her real salty about the Jimenez. So she still want to get that. Oh yeah. Get, oh yeah. Tap, tap, tapio. Tapio. Yeah. 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 She yeah. done gave up that little snatch. You know. So she she feels some sort of way about that. Mhm. <laughs> Tamika's gonna find that out too. See that why you can't mess with Angela, man. Ugh. Angela, yeah, she, Angela's crazy. Yeah, she 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 definitely gets messy. So 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 Quanda, do you have a different take on 
on Angela's angle, what do you what do you think Angela's approach for for uh, approaching Tommy for that deal? I mean, it's it's about the same. I think Angela is trying to use that tracker, um, probably to take take down someone else, so that she can get the the heat off of her. Because if she if she does that, the heat will be off of her as far as what she you know what she's trying to do. So I think that's it's all about her. She definitely got the okay. ghost syndrome. Like if okay. I need to get this off of me. That's why she was like, "Oh, Tommy, I'll give you immunity if this and that." So she really trying to do something big so she can really get it off her and she can look like, you know, she saved the day. Right. Okay. All right. B, you the you the last one. What's you 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 take it the same or you got some different? What's what's Angela's approach, man? What what's the deal with Angela? What's her angle? Hey, man, it ain't it ain't no secret. She she's a major part of the show. Um, when her back is against the wall, she she becomes ghost. She's a product of her environment. <laughs> she's, a, she, she's a fed that's living in an apartment. Come on, man. She gonna come. She gonna she gonna put her back up against the wall. She about to get her hands dirty. Cause okay. she already she already knee deep in it. So you know what I mean. It yeah. Is. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> she's a product of her environment. Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Okay. All right. Chiquita, so what's your most powerful moment in episode five, season five? Happy birthday. What what's what's your most powerful moment? Um, my most powerful moment I would definitely say, like I stated um earlier, is uh you know, the uh when Tommy took to reach for a uh, a little joy ride. Or whatever it may okay. be, or teaching them how to drive, whatever that it was, whatever that was. But um, I really think that shows that um, it kind of turns it around, and it shows that Tommy is not as messy as we think he is, and he's real smart. And it's gonna show that maybe leading up to the end of this season, that we're gonna be looking at Tommy. And what Tommy okay. has going on because Tommy got a lot going on this season. Like he got those, um, you know, he got his connect coming after him. I mean, he got his dad. Now the Italians don't like him, so it's a lot now riding on Tommy, and that kind of show, you know, that Tommy is smart and and he's gonna get his way out of it the best way he can and try to be, you know, his own connect. And so he can okay. sell them drugs because that's all Tommy wants. Tommy want to sell them <laughs> drugs, just like Kane. That's all them boys like. I feel you. All right. Okay, Rashawn, what, what's your most powerful moment in uh, episode five, Happy Birthday? Yo, I had, I had several that came to mind, and they, they, all, they all involved to read, you know. Um, so... I won't touch on the one that Keita just did there with, with Tommy and Tariq in the car, but another one was the confrontation with his drunk father. You know, okay. um, when when Ghost came home drunk, missed his whole party. You know, and he just he just wowed on him like, I don't want these fucking sneakers. I don't want nothing like that. So you saw like. The, the the maturation of, of, like, from, like, a boy to, like, trying to be a man. This was not the first time that he's, like, bucked up at goats, you know. And I think what's going to really happen is going to be, uh, gonna be a, a twist in, in this whole thing where he going he gonna to want to get the game from goats and be a part of the game, like, you know, like curiosity, you know, Ghost has tried to do so much to keep him away from it, but it's in his DNA, whether whether he like it or not. Like, if, even when Kanan was showing him how to get in the houses and whatnot, he was nice with it, right? So, like, right. He, he's, he's, it's in his DNA to be in it. So no matter how much 
ghosts has tried to keep him away, that point right there was like, yo, I am you. I am a product of you. You need to just teach me what it is that I need to know that I can be that I can excel in the game because I think Ghost wants to be Jamie. So why not give Tariq the Ghost ah. and, and let mm. Tariq go on? So I think you saw that 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 maturation from from boy to man standing up to his to his father at that point um, was real pivotal. And I know Keita was like, little boy, sit down. But I got I got a strong suspicion, even with Tommy putting the bug in his ear in the car, you about to see something different with Tariq. Okay. Okay. That's different. Okay. All right. All right, Quanda. What's your most powerful moment? Episode five, season five, happy birthday. Well, mine is going to have to be with same same thing is kind of like what Rashawn said, but I still I have a different perspective of it though. I was thinking uh Tariq and that whole situation with him and and Jamie or Ghost when he came in drunk or whatever, but I think it really that was powerful because Ghost got to see and got to understand that all of that he was trying to do and like make the house and everything that didn't make his son happy. He really lost like his family in this really time to give up ghost and go on and move along with Jamie because his his son he he lost his daughter. His daughter's gone. Now his son is gone as well because he don't respect him. They don't, all that he thought he was doing for him, Tyreek did not want all that. He said, fuck all this. Tyreek said that, like, I don't, all this stuff you talk about, material stuff, that ain't, that ain't make me happy. That's not what I want. Tasha gone. You see what I'm saying? His family is gone. So he, he got to come to the realization, like, all that he thought he was doing to keep his family or to keep them all together, whatever, it's all gone now. That little dream he had when he was younger and in the hood and stuff, and all that's gone because of that drug game. He lost it to the drug game. So they gone, wow. so he really need to come to his senses that he need a, a new life. He needs a new life now. And it may be just going along with being Jamie. Wow. So you, you're you saying that the drug game is, is a double-edged sword to him. It, it gave him everything, but it's also mm-hmm. taking everything away. Wow, but the most important, mm-hmm. yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's dope. That was okay, good. B. Yeah. All right, B, it's on, it's on you, yeah. man. What's, what's your most powerful moment? Season 5, uh, episode 5, the double nickel. Um, that, that was, that was tough. Um, because you know, with that with that scene, I'm I'm gonna go away from that scene since everybody picked it. But that that was like the most craziest moment. But we also have the moment where <laughs> where Ghost got drunk and he grabbed Councilman Tate. Like we all wanted that. <laughs> like like we all we we we've been waiting on him to peel his ass. You know what I mean? Like he grabbed right. Councilman Tate. You know what I mean? I was mad because like all the people in there like that shit fucking with his image and shit. You know what I mean? Like. Right. Like his image is tainted, like you know what I mean. Like then he was like, yeah. "Nigga, I kill you, nigga." You know what I'm saying? Right. Like hopefully, <laughs> hopefully they didn't hear him say that. You know what I'm saying? Because like when when you look at it, right? You look at it and then like the pastor come up to him and you know what I'm saying? He called him son. He was like, I "Ain't your son, nigga." You know what I mean? He like, "Oh shit, what's going on?" So you know, like we we see we see ghosts. We like, damn, boy, my boy losing it. You know what I'm saying? And and then you know what I'm saying they 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 they, they reach their goals and you know what I'm saying hey look you see ghosts falling apart and come up man he he a drug dealer you know what I'm saying like, what <laughs> hey he was losing himself man yeah, I said boy my boy fucked up <laughs> you're right well and then you the councilman Chase said that you know you done fucked up. <laughs> 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 
Yeah. 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 He definitely came loose with the scene. But, um, you know, a lot of people, I guess y'all touched on that. I'm, I'm going <clears> to <throat> go to a different place as well. I'm going to go when when uh, when Ghost and, and Stern was talking. He was like, man, you're just going to let him do this and do that. And and, uh, and 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 Stern told him, hey, man, you you know, that's the, you know, when another scene, he told him that that's, the, that's what you created. You, you created him. You know, so... So that set set the stage of to me, and uh, I'll go ahead and tip my hat to Chiquita, but for for saying this, and you know, a few episodes ago, that set the stage on for Ghost fighting Ghost. You know, we know who Ghost is, we know how smart and intelligent he is, how he always seems to 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 land on his feet, but now it seems like he's sparring with himself with with Dre. Yeah, Dre don't Dre don't have all the smart goals has, but he's gaining resources, you know, uh, i.e. Councilman Tate, you know, and 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 who else, you know, uh, Councilman Tate introduced him to. So he, so Dre is Dre is definitely gaining gaining momentum. So that's that that that's one of my you know most powerful moments in uh, the Double Nickel, uh, season five, episode five. But hey. Here it is, man. This is my favorite part of the night, favorite part of the show. <clears throat> so we're going to go ahead, man. We're going to go ahead and go with the newcomer first. You know, we're going to go ahead and break <laughs> him in. Come on, bring, go ahead. bring it. Oh, yeah. Bring it. Give we're gonna it go to ahead him. And, and, Give it to <laughs> him. We're going to go ahead and pop the newcomer's chair. Let's go. What? Um. <clears throat> it's, it's fairly easy, though, but here it is. Ghost got you believing you can't do shit without him. Um, that's far too easy. Um, yeah, that's yeah. uh, that's Kanan. Okay. Um, okay. when Tommy and and him were talking in in that apartment, I think it was Tommy's apartment. I want to say. Okay. All right. All right. B, here All we right. go. <laughs> I know you gonna come for me. <laughs> we'll always be family, but that's all we'll be. Mm. Oh shit! That's 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 when old boy was cutting their ass off on the Italian. <laughs> who who who's old boy? Shit, the one that gave Teresa the gun. Shit, I can't even think of his damn name right now, but you know who the hell he is. You, you know need a light? Nah, huh? we ain't doing we ain't doing live. We ain't doing lives no more. We 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 five episodes in, so it's it's either a point for y'all or a point for me. But you know, I take half y'all. I take half y'all. Take half. Vincent's his name. Vincent. Yeah. 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 I, I can I can live with that. I mean, hey, I'm okay. a I'm a caring guy. I give points. All right. <laughs> I right, hear. Okay, Quanda, here we go. Wiggle away, my good man. <laughs> Wait a minute, I'm sorry. <laughs> Wriggle away, my good man. <laughs> Wriggle away, my good man. Wiggle away. Okay. My good man. Don't Ooh. ask Google, ask me. <laughs> Ain't no ask. Is, is, is he your point or my point? <laughs> Oh, I don't know rules up on us, man. You yeah, you we know. Fought so. Nah, we we five episodes in now. You know, I I, I mean, I want to beat y'all. So now it's it's me against y'all. Come on, hmm. Wanda. Wiggle away, Wiggle away, my, away, good, my good man. I don't know. I have we, no clue. But who I'm you want to pass? Pass that to Kwanda. I'm not Oops. passing. I got it. I mean, tequila. I don't have a clue, but I'm gonna take a guess. Okay. And I think that's Tommy. Mm-hmm. That's Tommy. That's mm-hmm. that's Tommy. That's Tommy's verbiage. Wriggle away, my good man. <laughs> I don't like how you're saying that. That's what I don't like. That, that, that's how he said it. You trying to sound, but you trying to use your, you know, your no, voice to like. No, I'm trying to use hmm. my voice to sound like him. 
Well, you know, you did. So you, she, you, you, so she could have passed. She could have passed. We, we used to. We used no, to. No, I can't pass. Well, there's oh. no passing now. So I'm gonna just go ahead and. Hey, get hey, it. hey! But but you didn't change the rules though. Like you told us, like right now, like you should allow her to pass it though. <laughs> I agree because no, the rules no, wasn't told no, you know what? at the beginning there, of the game. So I, I agree, B. I agree, B. Good save. From here on out, okay, from here on out, this episode on. No pass. It was either my point or yours. Okay, my good woman, pass away. <laughs> pass away. I'm gonna pass it. I'm gonna pass it to B. Kita kind of kind of um, quiet. She might not know. <laughs> that was hey. Since, since she passed it to me, that was stern. Stern. That's stern. Yeah. Damn man, damn stern. so stern. Yeah, I went to, to Berlin word, and I came back for this shit. <laughs> hey, hey, to this man, to this man. Hey, but uh, this, all you God, do you so God, how that? Yeah. Mm. Okay, mm-hmm. okay, Kita. Chiquita. Oh, okay. Here we go, y'all. I'm here. I'm not taking no loss because I got me. Right. <laughs> right. Just ask for something about Angela. I <laughs> you need to stay away from James. And out from his influence. <laughs> oh, shit. See, it took, you need, it took us laughing, man. Let me hear what, let me hear what the guy said. Okay. <laughs> you need... Y'all ready? Here we go. You need to stay away from James and out from under his influence. Man. Pass that to Kwame. Oh, that's... um. That's too easy. That's um that's uh councilman Tate. Councilman mm. Tate. <laughs> no. Oh, she didn't mean to say that. She's joking. <laughs> April, April Fool. She thinking what? I know well, I'm living thinking. tonight. I got two tonight. I'm living tonight. Kita had answered that too oh, fast. No, no. I know what she thinking that though. Is, no, I know who that is. See y'all been doing all that laughing. That was silver. That's silver. <laughs> That's silver. Okay, B, here they, we go. What they do at Keita? What they do? Hold up, hold up. Who's this on? It's you, B. Oh, okay. Back at me. All right. <clears throat> you fucking mutt. <laughs> you fucking mutt. It's been chaos <laughs> since you came around. You understand that? <laughs> <laughs> That's easy. <laughs> That's that's the rest of homeboy. It should have had a bullet in that bitch. That's him. Yeah. <laughs> What's his name? Boy, I'm gonna get another half off you. Um, who knows, Dang, who knows his name? B, you ain't good who with Sammy. 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 That's okay. his name. Sammy. And get what I, I was okay. about to call his ass Steve too. Shit. <laughs> hey. All right, Quanda. Mm. <laughs> All right. Just like <laughs> <I think. laughs> True. You don't believe that. You don't believe that bullshit. Oh, oh no. That's, that's what you're giving me? That's what I'm giving me. That ain't enough. That's what it, that's what it is. Oh, man. Oh, but I know what that is, though. That was, uh, okay. that's ghost. When he said it to me. <laughs> okay, then. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, okay. Stand up, then. Do your thing. Brush your shoulders off. Yeah. yeah. Keto right. wouldn't have got that. Keto wouldn't have got that. Okay. I got one for <laughs> Keto right here. I'm about, I'm about to break just it down. Wait. Just make it show y'all up. All right. Okay, Keto, here we go. He fucking mm. owns me. That's mm. it? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. He fucking Say owns me. Say it one more time. Well, I, he better. He fucking owes me. Damn, I just had to throw, throw a little bit more that I remember. You know what I'm saying? The almanac. Yeah, you had to twist that up a little bit. Man, Kita, the beginning. Kita, if you want, Kita, if you want to, you can pass it to me. I will help you now. Kita, don't pass it to him. You can pass it to me, though. Or me. Kita, Kita got too know much that. pride, though. Mm. Oh, 
Shakita, yeah, you Shakita, did, you falling off tonight. I gave, yeah, I gave you a little extra. I gave you a little extra. He did give a little extra with this one. <clears throat> Man, right. um, I'm about to, I'm gonna I'm go about to pass count. it to the newcomer. Go ahead, Rashawn. So that's um, that's Tommy Dad. Terrestrial. <laughs> okay, man. That's Tommy Dad. Mm-hmm. Terrestrial. All right, yeah, Rashawn, here Tina. we go. I'm still trying to think of Naomi. Oh, yeah, that was because, because he was talking to he was talking he to Sammy and the whip. He was gonna shoot Sammy. Yeah, he was gonna shoot mm-hmm. Sammy. He stared Tommy, so he was yeah. saying, "Oh, you know. okay, okay, I got yeah. it." Yeah. Who the who the yeah. next one for? Who this right here for uh, this right here for Rashawn. Okay, yeah. Okay. All right. I don't give a fuck. Take the shoes too. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, that's oh, uh, come on. that's gaining that's to um. Uh, K Dot Lace uh, Crack character. Yeah. Lace. Yeah. Okay. All right, Quanda, here we go. It was definitely Dre. <laughs> <laughs> that was <clears throat> that was Tommy. Nope. Inco- incorrect. <laughs> that was Oh, that wait a minute. Let me try one more time. Wait, God. Now, see, you let your, you let your woman try a second time. He didn't even give me a chance. No, no that, was, that, was, that was that was Rashawn jumped all over that. Oh, my God. That was, What's going on here? That was the new car. Hmm? Oh, the new car. Oh, you get, don't know the rules. Oh, you get oh more no. No, no, he not really. No, not really. I mean, you but can she, have she a have chance to, to think about it and change. Yeah, she, yeah, she, you know, she can pass it. But once you throw something out there, it, it, it's my point. But you know, I, I, you know, not, I that's not y'all. true because that not hap- that didn't happen with Shakita. What? Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Am I wrong? First, once she said it the first time, it's my point. I just entertained her. That's all. Oh, I was just making sure well, y'all was sleeping. I thought y'all were making sure y'all was up. Let me okay. know something now. You knew damn well there ain't been no counseling tape. Well, no. <laughs> <laughs> it's, 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 as soon as councilman came out your mouth, it was over. But, um. <laughs> Dang, I'm right, about Chiquita. to say, let me know something. Chiquita, we're back on you. All right. All right. See the forest through the trees, motherfucker. <laughs> if any of my church people listening, man, I'm in character right now, so you know what. <laughs> That's um. Wow. Let me What's uh. Like? Let me do it. Let me do it like B. Um. You know, this was the part set the when. Scene. <laughs> let me set the scene. Emoji laughing faces. I set I set the scene and passing it to B. Go ahead. Wow, you don't know that either. Wow. <laughs> Trash <Trash-a-mate. laughs> <laughs> Trash the night. Oh, oh, she is Dang, the worst. You say trans. <laughs> that was painting. Incorrect. <laughs> hey, why why was a pause with the incorrect? Oh my god. <laughs> oh, Dang Keita. That's all right. I'll come back next next time. Help help out, Quan. No, she she said you. <laughs> no, no. Oh, I want, Chita, I want, it. I need somebody to set the scene. Chiquita, <laughs> give it to somebody. I, I said go. I'm giving it to me. Oh, no, you, no, you can't pass it to me. 
He said that. Who you said it was? So we trying That's to get. She That's passed it to the scene setter. No, she said it was Canaan. I passed it to the scene setter. Go ahead, B. The scene setter. <laughs> oh, boy. Be quiet. Well, B don't know. Chirp, 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 chirp. B don't know. Yeah. Oh, what you see? What about the newcomer? The newcomer, though? Go ahead, yeah. Man. Brownsville. That was too easy. That's easy. Let's say something. Uh-uh. Pass Tommy. me the hard one. That's Tommy. That's Tommy. Pass, That's me, the, Tommy. pass me the hard one. See the forest through the trees, Tommy. motherfucker. When was That's that? Tommy. When was that? Set the scene for us that? again? Um, uh, I think they was in the house and they was talking. Um, it was, I think, yeah. Canaan, Tommy, and Ghost. Yeah. That's all correct. Oh, oh that wasn't mm. even no big scene. Uh, it's not going to always be a big scene, Chiquita. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Keita, all right. Keita say, Keita say go big or go home. All right. <laughs> oh, B, you all let right. me down like no, kid. Okay. <laughs> I'm, go. I'm the goat. <laughs> okay, here we go. Who this for? Let me make sure I stay up. Keep y'all easy. Okay, this was supposed to be Brownsville, but uh, might be a tad too easy for him. Okay. Because I end up switching the questions and gave uh, you key to questions, but I'm going to go ahead and give it to you. Mm, see, you trying to get me tonight. <laughs> we mm, already have better. a black on the team. Uh-uh. <laughs> we already have a black on the team who's bootstrapped his way to the top of the industry. <laughs> Andre team so <laughs> it's done. Oh, that was good. Uh, yo, that's wild. That That's for me, kid? <clears throat> Yeah, yeah. That should have been for so Keita. Redundant. Uh, yeah, Keita yeah. Initially. Yeah, that's 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 wild boy uh Stern again, yo. That's Stern. That's Stern. All right, we already got you. a black. <laughs> All right, uh, or, or that's you done boot, he Cole? said bootstrap. <laughs> B, are you still working with Andre Coleman? Wow, really? Oh, come on, Tommy. Really? Yeah, that's for you. Yeah. Oh. That, that was that, was that little piece this... he can't get over. That's that little Angela piece. Mm-hmm. Angela. That's that Angela. All right, Chiquita. I see, you what, say I, see what the host, I see what the host doing tonight, giving the girls the hard ones tonight. Here you go, Chiquita. Who told you to say that? <laughs> Go. <laughs> you guys are laughing, not listening. <laughs> I got it. I... <laughs> Who is it? Oh, that's um Silver. Come on. What the fuck? Keep quit playing. I'm about to mute my phone. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, you're mm-hmm. make, making a mark, like, making a mockery out of this part of the show. This is my favorite part of the show. You're playing around. <laughs> <laughs> I'm passing it to Kwanda. See you, the oh, girl. Shit. <laughs> girl, girl power. Oh shit. Move Kwanda, need to say it again. <laughs> no, that Keep was. On the that was Tommy. That's Tommy. That's mm-hmm. definitely Tommy. Okay. Okay. All right, Rashawn, here you go. <clears throat> Tasha, your kids are here. Oh, that's um that's, that's, that's a mama. 
Uh-huh. Nobody knows her name. I put yeah, that yeah, on my yeah. mama. Yeah. I don't think mama. they ever did. She, they ever say her name in it? I, I don't think I ever heard. Okay, okay, Quanda. <clears throat> I ain't your son, nigga. Hmm. I think I got one. I think I got another one. <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't know that one. <laughs> Whatever, B. I mean, sometimes I ain't it ain't so funny. He on top all the time. Yeah, you right. Uh, hey, I totally agree. I am the, I am the mm. goat. I will be. I am the goat. Mm. Quanda, I got you. Wait a minute, let me repeat, think. Repeat, repeat it for her. Yeah, repeat it for me, please. I ain't your son, nigga. Mm. I got it. <laughs> that gotta be... That gotta be Canaan. That is not Canaan. That ain't Canaan. <clears throat> Oh, man. Oh, Correct. Man. Oh. <laughs> pass it, Kwanda. Pass it. Hey. I'm going to pass it. Come on, pass Kita. it. Me. I'm going to pass it to Kita. Mm-hmm. Okay. That was gold, man, when he lost it in the club. Oh, freak. Yeah. With the preacher. That was, yeah. that was definitely ghost after, you know, wig got and mad slizzard. And, you know. Hey. <laughs> Yeah, right before he went off. Right. Right. Mm. All right. Yeah, right Angel. before he lost it. Right before Angel, he went. nigga. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Sure did. All right. All right. Well, the newcomer, you're gonna you're gonna shut us down tonight. Uh, mm. I hope it's a hard one. It, it isn't. Hmm. <laughs> That's yeah. You. Was, <laughs> you. Mm. <laughs> You know you done fucked up, right? <laughs> oh. <laughs> you know, Yo, you, know you, you know you done fucked up, right? Yo, I lost it with that kid, man. Uh, <laughs> a better one would have been with uh, would have been like when Ghost said, "You don't know who I am." Oh now I yeah, do. yeah 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 now yeah um, yeah yeah now I do. What would make a man kill over a business dispute? That's uh that's the councilman there. Um, yeah, that said that. It, so. Yeah, that that definitely councilman councilman Tizzy. Councilman right. Tate. Councilman Tate. All right, first off, I want to definitely uh, thank you guys for being with me tonight. I want to thank all the listeners for coming in and listening. And I just want to, I guess, the, does anyone want to leave with anything? Rashawn, newcomer, you got anything you want to leave the listeners with? Hey, man, um, I just I just want you guys to tune in to, to my guys' podcast here. Awesome. I really appreciate you guys having me as a special guest uh, tonight. Really fun, interesting uh, perspective. Gave me new uh, thoughts and ideas about the show, so – um, tune in. This is it's a great podcast and, and something to definitely check out on a weekly basis. So I thank you all for having me. Thank you. I, I appreciate it. And hopefully it won't be your last time being on the show. Uh, Quanda, what do you want to leave them with? Uh, I just enjoyed myself tonight and just want to see you guys back next week. All right. Beezy. Mr. B, what are you going to leave him with? Um, I am the GOAT. And, um, <laughs> you know, and I'm, and I'm cool with that. And I, hey, I know my I know my <laughs> listeners out there cool with it too, man. You know, hey, players mess up every now and then. But, hey, I came back um, determined to, to stay the GOAT. Okay. I feel you. All right. Ch- Chiquita Valdez, what do you want to leave him with? Valdez. 
<laughs> hey, I probably and I, I'm with B. I, I took a loss tonight, but hey, <laughs> there's always room to come back. I'll be back. Yeah, that's 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 the thing about uh <laughs> being on the bottom. There's it, nowhere else to go but up. And so right now you're on the bottom. <laughs> <laughs> hey, 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 I want to I want to thank you guys again and uh follow us uh go to com. follow go to life listen to the podcast have a great night we'll see you guys same time next week man man and y'all hey enjoy y'all yeah. weekend man when you get here man Thank you. Good night, everybody. Night. Peace.